Aquaculture really touches all of our lives. About 60% of the fish that we eat today is farmed. Also in the US, we import 90% of the seafood that we eat. So where are these fish coming from? Who are the people behind that? And how can we tell their story? When I first came on to GAA, a lot of the material that I was finding to educate myself was too scientific, too long. So I started thinking about, okay, how can we talk about it in a relatable, personal way? Seat Lolly's family came across my desk through an associate of ours, and we had a call with her, and I was so impressed by her passion and openness. When we first got down there, I think we were thinking the film would be acutely focused on Seat Lolly and her perspective and, you know, her sort of day-to-day. -day. Once we spoke with her family, this amazing family is thinking about these wider issues of deforestation and the future of their farm and the history of the place that they live. So we started to develop a narrative that was more based in the future of the farm. What I love about this story is that Seat Lolly and her family really encourage alternative livelihoods for the people in the community. The water in Zitakuro is the water that they also use for drinking water in Mexico City. That inspires Seat Lolly and her family in being you know, not only farmers, but to also be environmentalists. In their case, you can really see where aquaculture and conservation can go hand in hand. Now that we've launched the film, we've had an incredible amount of positive feedback from the aquaculture community. They're really enjoying these stories from the more personal side of aquaculture. There's just an unlimited amount of stories to tell out there. Every location that we go to is another opportunity to showcase what responsible aquaculture can look like for the future. We are at the point where we're asking people to partner with us on that, to really communicate that message to a wider audience. GAA exists to advocate and educate for responsible and sustainable aquaculture. And that's why GAA Films is such a good fit for what we do, because we really want to demonstrate it. This is all great stuff.